You know, at 530, we continue to collect items for our Stuff the Backpack school supply drive. And today, 31 Gifts, which is based right here in Central Ohio, donated boxes of bags and school supplies to add to our goal of making sure that every Columbus City school student returns to class with a backpack. Teachers say a backpack full of supplies is essential to a child's success in the classroom. A new backpack we plan for every student in the Columbus City School District to call their own. NBC4's John Lanier has more on how it benefits a child's entire health. Many students here at Livingston Avenue Elementary were prepared when this school year started because they had their backpacks and supplies. Are you happy to be back in school? Yeah. Yes. No? <laughs> no, you're not ready to learn? Yeah. Yes. So I understand when you started school, everyone got a backpack, right? Yes. And was it filled with all the goodies and stuff that you need? Yes. We felt like the backpacks were essential to make sure these students were ready for a successful school year. These third graders at Livingston Avenue Elementary received some of the backpacks collected by NBC4's Stuff the Backpack School Supply Drive. So far, we've collected more than 45,000 backpacks, but we aren't stopping there. Columbus Health Commissioner Dr. Myshika Roberts says these supplies put every child on a path to success. We realize the, the value of education. Um, without good education, with a solid foundation of education, you can't have a healthy lifestyle. I had never seen anything like this in all my experience in Columbus City Schools. Principal Stacy Harris McCarthy has worked in the Columbus City School District for more than 20 years. She says the goal of providing backpacks to every student was ambitious, but the impact is great. I was uh, pleasantly surprised for my older children. A lot of times they did not use backpacks, but I found that they actually wanted them and wanted the supplies that were in them. So it let me know that maybe it was more of a need that I didn't want to say that I had. The principal says now the teachers can spend their money on other items for the classroom instead of supplies and backpacks. Local for you in Columbus, Sean Lanier, NBC4.